how to create the environment in Google Cloud Composer for Airflow. So in our previous video, we uh, discussed about uh, what is Apache Airflow and what is Google Cloud Composer. So let's go and check how to create uh, environment so that we can run the Apache Airflow pipelines. So for that matter, we should have a project here. So we have this project. When we log into Google Cloud Platform, we will have access to these services out of which I'll go to Composer. So I have already one environment created here. If I have to create here. Just give some name. Let's data. For example, I'm creating this environment for dev cluster. So we have to specify what is the node configuration since uh, this Apache Airflow software will be running on Google Kubernetes engine and Google Kubernetes engine will run in distributed mode so that we will specify the minimum three node count so that if you want a higher workload, you can increase the node count. The default is minimum three and it will be running airflow pipelines in distributed mode. So I will give here three node count. Location can be anything where uh, the Google Cloud has its regions where the clusters can be created. For example, US Central 1. Let's see. So it will have multiple zones out of which the C is selected by default. And in this particular zone itself, the Apache Airflow will be installed on VMs which are part of this zone. Machine type, if not selected, it is normal N1 standard 1 and N1 standard 1 has uh, 1 CPU and 3.75 like 4 GB RAM. Uh, I'll not provide the de uh, these details, it will automatically take the defaults like default to 100 GB, OAuth specification is for authorization, then service account is default for the compute engine because in background the compute engine compute instances are running i will not uh, give any of this we can give python version since if if i am not giving anything it's it will take it as a default values airflow configuration if you want to uh, give some configuration that needs to be already done in your airflow uh, environment you can give here environment variable for the system and labels can also be provided uh, networking will it will take the default values I'll check if it will get created it's saying that it is creating uh, we'll wait for it so we can see that uh, this pipeline or the environment gets created its name is let data dev us central one region this is the timestamp values and this is the airflow url generated for this particular environment we created so we'll try to log in to airflow apache airflow uh, yes so it's getting created yeah so this is the airflow environment that we recently created it will have a default airflow DAG present so similarly we will have our DAGs here so for that matter, you have to place your DAX inside this Google Cloud Platform storage bucket, which is created for Airflow DAX. And you just place your DAX here. It will automatically get reflected in Airflow environment. Since it is mapped, uh, so you can see this is the bucket name where you should place the DAX. This is because we are actually creating this composer environment which will be connected to this airflow in uh, airflow pipeline we can say this environment this will be the setting if you want to go through the configurations that you set and the monitoring part you can do in this composer and the scheduling and running logging you can check here 